Arizona Toy Fair in Glendale. Getting ready to go inside. Just pulled up, just parked. So uh, let's go in there and see what, what, what we have, what they got. Yeah, just parked, getting ready to go in. And look, guys, freaking Type R right here. So we're in the Glendale Civic Center is where this is at. Walking up to the front. Guys, we're in the toy fair. What's up, guys? Hanging out with Forge, Forge Man. Man Forge Man 84. Right. That's where you're gonna find him. Spent some money. Yeah. Seems like dog. We got uh, Frank Camacho here in the wild, catching these wild bees out here. This is how he does yeah. it. This is how he does it. All your Mustangs are here. Oh, Mustang hunters buying me gifts. Purple Passion, Zamek. Dude, that is, is so uh, nice. Number 15, I don't know what year it's from. 2013 maybe? Man, thanks. Dude, there's still a crazy line to get into this place. Hey, I like your handle. Yeah. I actually park. Right, guys that toy con was a success yeah i spent way too much money yeah, but then i was, got like bamboozled and spending money. <laughs> yeah. then i was uh and i was giving like three tables i was giving gifts by this guy <laughs> me too got a couple cars yeah hooked me up uh mustang hunter at you all right it's gonna be the last and, uh, maybe actually, the last convention that will this one right here my buddy eric here hooked me up with this set i've been looking for forever yeah so we're and it's, glad to have I, was, that. I felt so bad because I, I seen like four sets of these. I saw, I was him, just in like, your, oh. I saw him in your video. <laughs> and and he was like, like, Did you tell me you left that? And I was like, <laughs> I didn't even think about it. I was like, You could just have mine. And then he goes back and he shows me a picture, and all the pigs are completely empty. All the regular pigs, all yes. the it's bad. premiums. <laughs> well, and it's been dry. Yeah. Well, if there's any fresh drops, now would be the time because everybody's here. I bet. You know what? Yeah, not a lot of hot wheels. Yeah. I'll right. have to race you yeah, to Target. Sure. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we'll have to see whose Mustang is faster. 
So, anyway, I'm gonna go. Let's go home and yeah. go through this stuff. All right, guys. See you guys. See ya. Peace. 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 Man, that Glendale, the Toy Fair, the Glendale Toy Fair, crazy. There were so many people there. I did not expect there to be that many people. But as you saw, I, uh, I met up with some people uh, while I was there. I saw Ford's Man 84, he was there, and um, and the Mustang Hunter. Mustang Hunter has stickers now. I mean, for now, the Mustang Hunter lives down the street from me. It's gonna change soon though, he's gonna move across country, but. Yeah, saw those guys there, and uh, while I was there, I was able to pick up some good stuff. Not only that, I mean, the Mustang Hunter, he actually bought some, he bought me some cars too, so. So let's uh, let's turn this around and, and take a look at the stuff that I picked up at the uh, Glendale Toy Con, Toy Fair. All right, let's jump into this bag of cars. Um, so what do we got here? Okay, yeah, so I picked up a second one of these. I mean, come on, it's a, the Datsun wagon. It's the Bluebird 510 wagon. So I picked up a second one of these because I already have it. I have it here loose. So yeah, I have it loose. Um, I don't know. Don't think you have too many Datsuns. Datsun man will agree with that. Uh, oh yeah, check this out. So the Mustang Hunter gave this to me. Um, he was just, you know, he hooked me up with this one. Look at how cool that looks. It's Mercedes AMG. The GTR. GT3. AMG GT3. That is so cool. Didn't have it. He asked me if I had had one. And I was like, no, you know, I never actually grabbed this cast. So yeah, he hooked me up with it. That is so nice. Here, we'll stick that on top of his sticker. Right here. <laughs> yeah. Jumping more into this bag, look at this. First edition Lamborghini Murcielago. Look at that yellow. Tail lights are done. That looks nice. So yeah, like the Lamborghinis. I like this car. Murcielago. Very nice. Very nice. And then we've got Okay, so I grabbed a second one of these. Someone gave me one of these a while back. I got one and uh, I just never took it out of the blister. So I grabbed a second one so that I could take it out of the blister and put it up in the shelf. So I have this RSR here. This is one, this is one that I talked the Mustang Hunter out of, <laughs> out of his collection. Well, I traded him some cars so that I can get this one, but I picked up a second one of these. Cause like I said, I I was sent one a while back, uh, but I wanted one to have loose. So grabbed the second one to have it loose. That's why I have that there. So what do we got here? Zamac. Chevy Impala Zamac. I don't know if that's a one or a seven, but it's from last year. So it's either in the first or second release of the Zamax. I think that's a one. I think this might be from the, the first release of 2020 on the Zamax. So what's, what's better guys, Zamax or Red Edition? That is the constant debate I always have. Ah, check this out, okay, so Datsun 510. I saw this in a, in a box, I, you know, I pulled it up and I was like, oh, that's cool. And then I put it back in the box and I did that with another car too. And the Mustang Hunter, he grabbed them, bought them for me and then gave them to me. So that's cool. Cause now I have, I have a little matching set of the Datsun 510 Momos. So that's cool. Thank you Mustang Hunter for hooking me up with that. And I'm gonna thank you again for the other ones that you ended up, that you ended up picking me up. Oh, check this out guys. 67 Chevelle SS race team livery. Dang, that looks good. That white, I guess it's red, white, and blue, huh? A little patriotic going on there. Or you could say that it's white is the main color, blue, then red. That looks cool. 
I, I just, yeah, when I saw this, it stood out. I mean, it's a Chevelle. You can't go wrong. Can't go wrong with that. Up next, the next thing I got was, oh yeah, this uh, Copa Camaro Zamac right here. Um, looking through bins and actually the uh, Ford's man, Ford's man 84. He picked this up and showed it to me and said, what do you think of that? And I was like, I think I'm gonna buy that. So, <laughs> so yeah, Ford's man handed this to me as we were digging through, you know, boxes of cars. So there you go, uh, 2015 number four. That looks really good. I like that a lot. Again, you know, Zamac or Red Editions. I kind of lean towards the Zamacs, but Red Editions are cool. Here we go. Lamborghini Huracan, Super Trofeo. This car is cool and I love this color on this car. I have two other color variations of this. I have the uh, blue one and the white one. Um, they're up in the case in here. I'll get them down. I'll get them down so we can also look at them to compare. So here we go. So there's the blue one and there's the white one. And now I have the gold. But yeah, Lamborghini Super Trofeo. Very cool, very cool casting. Get these cars back up in their cases up here. Up tall, up tall. All right, up next. Let's see, what else do we got in here? Oh, okay, so this is the other car that I grabbed, I picked up when I picked up this, uh, this. I picked up both of these and I was like, oh man, those are cool. But then I was like, ah, I've already spent all my dollar bills and I, so I put them back in the box. I wasn't gonna grab them because like I said, I spent most of my dollar bills already. And uh, the Mustang Hunter, he grabbed those. He picked those up for me, so thank you. Thank you, Mustang Hunter. I'm gonna be sad when he actually finally moves away from me. It's kind of nice to have him down the street. Purple Passion Zamac. So I, this is another one that the Mustang Hunter bought for me. And it was one of those things, I saw it, you know, we were digging through boxes and I kind of picked it up. I was like, oh man, Purple Passion Zamac, that's cool. And then I set it down and he picked it up and he's like, you want this? And I'm like, yeah, I want this. And then he bought it for me. Look at the grill on the Purple Passion. That is just, that is nice. I like that. The way the Hot Wheels is integrated into the pinstriping. That is just gangster. Gangster, love it. All right, what else do I got in here? What else, let's see. Ooh, guys, look at this. This is nice. It's a Pontiac GTO, that black with the race team livery. It's like that matte black, silver interior. Or chrome. There's a the car. Yeah, there it is. 69 purple pon or purple Pontiac GTO. Gosh, that looks really good. That looks really good. I love that matte black. That card art looks cool too. That's a cool looking card also. That would be a fun set to have. Hmm. Maybe I should go on a hunt. Start trying to track these down because it looks like there are some really cool castings in here. But that is really nice. I like that a lot. So I saw that, had to have it, grabbed it. So, oh yeah, look at this Ferrari F40. Guys, you know, when I see Ferraris that are affordable, I grab them, I pick them up quick because Hot Wheels isn't making Ferrari anymore. I don't think they ever will. I don't think Ferrari is coming back to Hot Wheels. So, so yeah, there's, so I grabbed this one and I grabbed another Ferrari too. This is right here. I grabbed this Ferrari, the F40. And that's a blue card, F40, I don't know. I have no idea how old this thing is. No, don't see anything on the back of it. But man, that's cool. Grab that one. So I have a, the white F40, red F40. And then last but not least, get this bag out of the way. I grabbed 
this Porsche, this Porsche 930, blue card, gold card. But man, look at that, guys. Look at how just cool that is. It's all metal, metal base, metal body. I like that, that red, yellow stripe that says turbo. This is nice. I like that a lot. So this is, uh, yeah, this is what I grabbed at the uh, the toy fair. Um, it was lots of fun, lots of people. I was actually surprised at how many people were there. So coming to the end of this video, uh, it's time to do a photo montage. I think we should do it of this Mercedes right here. It's already loose and it looks amazing. So. Thanks for watching, guys. Um, let's get to this uh, photo montage. Here we go. <laughs> 